Hey everyone, I'm Mindy from Cute Girls Hairstyles and today I'm in Charlotte, North Carolina and I'm visiting with Evelina from Evelina Kutza. Some of you guys may already know her because she's seriously fantastic, but just in case you don't, I wanted her to quickly tell you a little bit about her channel. Hi, um, my name is Evelina, like Mindy said, I do a lot of fashion, DIY, and hair tutorials on my channel. Which of course is the most important part, right? The hair. Yep. So today we decided, since we're together, we're going to film a hair tutorial or two, one on her channel and one on mine, and it's going to be all things fabulous for buns. So check it out. Get yourself some buns. Get yourself some buns. Get yourself some buns. <laughs> They're going to be good. <laughs> So the hair tutorial we're going to do today we're calling cross braided bun. So what you're going to need is a bun maker. Now you can buy one like this at any of your local hair supply stores or you can just cut off the top of a sock and roll it up and make one out of a sock. But either way you're going to take it. Let me just show you what we've already done. We've already put her hair into a high ponytail and we've taken one little section behind each ear and created a braid. Once you have those two braids in place and the high ponytail, take the bun maker and we're gonna just slide it over the ponytail. And then I'm gonna take her hair and form, like I'm gonna throw it forward so that it completely covers that bun maker. And then take another elastic and slide it over the top of that. So now, tip your head just a little bit this way, you can see that we have this nice, round, pretty looking bun right here on her head. Now with the rest of her hair, what I'm going to do, now that it's already kind of fanned out, I'm going to grab a piece right here and just twist it, give it a little twist, and as I'm twisting, add in a little bit more hair, and I'm just going to wrap this around the base of her bun, and that's going to give her bun a really nice, soft look, and it's also going to take care of all of that excess hair for us. So you're just going to keep wrapping until you run out of hair and then just re-put the hair again and again until she's got really long hair so it's really twisting. And then I'm going to take a couple bobby pins and just secure the ends so that they don't loosen up. Maybe one more. Thank you. And we have this nice, soft, wrapped sock bun. But now we're gonna add a little pizzazz to it. So we're gonna take our braids and I'm just gonna cross. So this is the braid that's by her right ear and I'm gonna take it over to the left side and just cross it in front, down at the base, and then using another bobby pin, I'll show you on the other side so you can see better. Let me just secure this one. Okay, so take the one on the left side, cross it over, and then wrap it up whoop, and over the bun and then you can see where mine's ending right here. I'm just going to take that and hide that elastic and the end and then bobby pin it in. Like that. And what you're going to end up with, okay turn your head, is this pretty crisscross in the back of her hair on top of the gorgeous sock bun. And we're done. It's so easy, so simple, very fast, and you guys, I'm sure, will love it. What do you think, Evelina? I love it. I love it. I can see myself in there. Not <laughs> yet. <laughs> <laughs> I think it looks great. You can just hide I, that elastic right there. It needs to be hidden a little bit more there. And oh, it's perfect. Reflection. So we hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to go to Evelina's channel and check out the bun that we did on my hair. And that one's really fun, too, with lots of braids. But we'll see you guys later. See ya. Bye. Right there behind it, that becomes the middle strand. So you can see again, I've placed it in the middle. And now I'm going to cross that middle strand over the bottom strand. Got it. Are they both on? Mm -hmm. Okay. So today we're going to film a tutorial that we're calling hair. Oh. <laughs>